Many people ask me why I'm going to visit Bangkok. It may not be the most touristy city in Asia, but you have to know its essence and know how the local people live. Get to know the heart of this country and immerse yourself in the Thai culture and daily life of the locals. This capital will captivate your senses, so get ready to discover this amazing city. So let's start an adventure that you're going to love. We begin to discover Bangkok, a destination that will leave you wanting more. Grab something to drink, make yourself comfortable and keep watching. Guys, I've never seen a better shopping center. I think it's the best shopping center because you have like a market in the first floor, then you have all the other floors. And my favorite one is the apple one because you can go outside in the terrace and you can see the skyscrapers. It's very, very nice. So guys, I'm going to have lunch in this amazing place. I'm in the best shopping center ever. I'm so shocked. This is huge and I'm going to show you everything. I have finally my Thai outfit, which is amazing. And I'm going to show you my food. So I have this strawberry Coca-Cola, which looks very nice. Okay, so this looks very similar as the Pad Thai. And the cool thing is that they put this thing in the leaf. It's so beautiful. Opened in 2018, Icon Siam has become one of Bangkok's most popular places. This shopping center has luxury shops and even a floating market. So guys, this is the first floor and you have like a modern part like this and then the more traditional market. I wanted to go to a market so much but I didn't know where to go and this shopping center has everything you need. You should know that if you go to Bangkok, it is very, very hot and going to a shopping center like this to eat or have a walk is the best plan. Why don't you come sit next to me, let things happen naturally. Okay, so now we are entering the traditional market. You can find a lot of clothes, a lot of food, it's amazing. Like I was thinking all day about finding a market and without planning anything, I found the best market ever. Everything is so cute. This looks like a fake small village. It's so, so cute. So I think this is the main entrance. And here you start seeing all the traditional things. The decoration is amazing. Guys, I'm the happiest person in the world. I would live in this shopping center. They're offering the elephants some flowers. Oh my god, look at this. It's like a small temple here inside. And this is like the real, real market. This is like a market inside a shopping center. It's huge, guys. It's huge. I wish someone could take good pictures because these spots are like made for Instagram pictures. Look at this guys, it's so so amazing. Everyone is taking pictures here. Street markets are very typical in Asia and without a doubt being able to see all the local products is an experience that you must live. This makes me so sad and so angry. I don't like about this country that they eat a lot of seafood and meat. Look at this fruit. We have so many interesting fruits here.
now we are going to go to the best part which is the Apple store because I wanted to see the amazing amazing views by the way people are very nice here and if you ask them to take a picture of you they're going to do it they're usually putting a lot of effort which is very very nice okay so this basically is a normal shopping center but after seeing so many temples I like seeing something a bit modern so this is the Apple store and it's amazing because in the back side you can see the skyscrapers I've never seen this amazing Apple store anywhere and you can see the trees inside, it's amazing Something that surprised me about Bangkok is the contrast between traditional and modern and from this place you can see this clearly the view of these skyscrapers in front of the river are just impressive. So now I'm outside the Apple store and I'm going to show you all the buildings here. Bangkok's rapid transformation is evident in its modern architecture, infrastructure and increasing emphasis on sustainability. So Bangkok is embracing the future, blending tradition with modernity. Well guys, this is an amazing place to have a rest for a few minutes, enjoy the views, look at the river, it's just amazing. And also look at this building. The last floor is like an entertainment floor, have games and also the cinema. I would go but I would not understand anything. So now I'm just looking around. This is a Korean restaurant and it looks so, so nice. All the places I saw in Thailand were very clean and this was the same in Bangkok. Okay, so now we have the best views from the top terrace. Wow. This store is so so cute. Diving deep into the waves, babe. I know that you want it to. So this is my taxi driver right now. It's cheaper to go with a motorbike and faster because you go between the cars. And it's so crazy because before I was so scared and now I love it. So this is my last stop for today, I'm in Chinatown, I'm going to check all the small stores and the fruits and show you a bit. They say that during the night time this looks better because everything has lights, but still it's a nice place to visit if you come to Bangkok. I see that they're selling a lot of gold everywhere, like every two stores they're selling gold and basically that's it, it's a very short street. Yeah, so a lot of gold stores. So I'm definitely going to buy a coconut because it's so delicious. Okay, I changed my mind and I think I'm going to have one of these, they look so good. So I bought this juice from this amazing place, it looks so delicious, very delicious guys, amazing! I'm so sad, oh my god this fish is suffering so much, I think this is not okay, I'm so sad and this huge fish is here alone, almost without any water. So I just saw a sign to Cow Market, which is known for being the oldest and is a mixture between the Thai and Chinese community. So I'm going that way. So this is the place 
There's so many weird things and to be honest, I don't want to try any of them. But it's interesting to know that this is the oldest market here. But everything closes at 5 o'clock so that's why now it's closed and soon the sun will go down. Everything is so weird. Chinatown is a vibrant neighborhood and it is known for its street food and markets. Chinatown is a melting pot of cultures with many Chinese temples, restaurants and shops. So I'm waiting for my taxi, I'm having a coconut and I'm ready to go to my next destination. If you go to Bangkok, you must know that the distances are very big but this sunset is worth everything. So here my trip ends. Look at this, it looks so amazing. Oh my God, they're so, so, so big. And yeah, I will show you the airplane and you will know my next destination. I hope you enjoyed this Bangkok video. If you want to discover many other countries, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. See you in my next video.